The Cedar Falls Historical Society is like a little hidden gem that people don't really know about. And we are here to be a resource for the community. The mission of the Historical Society is to engage the community in the celebration, education, and preservation of our heritage. So we definitely emphasize that history can be something that happened yesterday as well as 100 years ago. The Cedar Falls Historical Society's museums actually encompass a campus uh, of multiple buildings. We have the Barron's Wrap gas station, which also serves as a tourist information uh, locale. We have a wonderful program at the Little Red Schoolhouse. We use it to tell the story of rural education in Iowa. Every summer, we have either five or six sessions, a week long each, and kids in each session get to spend their half day learning what it was like to be a kid in a one-room school. The ice house is truly unique. As far as we can tell, it is the only ice house in the United States that is being used as a museum of the ice house industry. The main floor of the ice house tells that history of ice cutting on the Cedar River. The top balcony tells the story of the Cedar River in the area. The Victorian home was, uh, they started to build it in 1862, and it's just a very nice example of an Italianate Victorian home. The Carriage House Museum is where we have our gallery and where our annual exhibit is. So the exhibit space, we have a rotating exhibit, it changes every year, so that we can highlight a different part of Cedar Falls' history and the classroom area allows us to do many different programs. When we set up our program series, I try really hard to make sure we've got something for kids, something for families, something for people who are interested in a lecture, something for people who are interested in a more hands-on workshop. The Historical Society is here to help us connect to the past, to show people what Cedar Falls was like as it was growing, to keep that history alive because we can learn so much we are also planning to build a new museum. It's at 315 Clay Street, which is just two doors down from the Victorian home. That museum will focus on business, industry, transportation, and agriculture in Cedar Falls. We have our website, which is cfhistory.org. We're also on Facebook and Twitter. You can always also just stop by here, the Victorian home. We're open uh, Tuesday through Sunday, or give us a call. And so if you have a question of history that you want to explore more deeply on your own, we have that available as well.